Hello, today I'm gonna be reviewing the Tsume Port Gas D. I think that's how you say it, Port Gas or Port de Gas D Ace from One Piece. This is a HQS uh, figure by Tsume. So let me open the box and, and see how, how the box looks. Okay, so far, this is how the, the box, the inside box looks. It came with that styrofoam. It was a little, it had a little, but a scratch or whatever, but I guess that's normal. The, the box looks normal. So let me get, let me get it out of the box and I'll, I'll show you how the, the box looks looks okay uh, I just got it out of the box and this is how the front or I think it's the front of the of the box looks this is how the the top part top part looks this is one of the sides and this is the other one it has like sume sume logo let me let me rotate the I was gonna do like a a 360 but man this this box is heavy so let me let me turn it around and and by the way I had to I'm super lucky because when I got a white bird all of this corner uh, st styrofoam they were like bended and all all messed up but this time they did like a pretty good job I'm pr I don't know if it was because this one's this one actually came straight from from Sume from France. The other one that I got from Whiteberry was like a a US website, so that might be the difference between this one and the other one. But I don't know. The only little thing was this that it was like a little dented, but that's not a big deal because it had like a pretty sturdy box inside, so. Let me rotate it, rotate the box so you can see and the other, the other side of the box. Hold on. Okay, here's the, here's the other part of the box. Let me see if I can do it like a close up. There you go. This is the content of the box. It's gonna have Ace and it's gonna have that big ball of fire, the smoke and the base with flames and all the different uh, steel structure and this is let me see if I can do a close up there you go that's the face of Ace and that's how it looks I guess and what I need to tell you this is like another side it's not gonna look like perfect because this is not in a perfect lighting uh, room but man what I'm like super lucky that it happened is that they made uh, 4,000 of these figures right? where is it? come on let me let me try to like do it like that I was like BAM son I got the 78 out of 4,000 I'm super lucky and I'm super excited that I got it so I'm like the this is the, this is the the first ones so let me see let me I guess get the big box and show you how it looks from from inside there the stereo, big styrofoam box. Hold on. Super excited. Okay, I already removed the the styrofoam styrofoam box, and this is how it looks. I, I like that logo from Sume. Just top. This is how you. This is what you see. I think this is a charger for the lighting stuff. That's the the ball, the fireball. That's Ace. 
and I think that's the whole base I'm not sure I need to remove everything that's the white bear uh, flag I mean cross and I think that's part, part of the structure and that's like the I don't know how to say this like, the label that says like a hey, this figure is it's a blah 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 so I need to remove everything and then assemble it and then I'll, I'll show it to you how it looks so just hold on and wait okay so far this is how the this is how the figure looks I already removed that that's the main main part of it that's the base where the explosion is coming up and you have to wear gloves this is recommended so you don't I guess so you don't put fingerprints on it but this is how it looks funny thing that well it's not funny but let me see if I can I don't know you can see let me, let me you're gonna hear a sound but that's fine, it's just gonna adjust. See, I like how even the electrical board, board has like so me on it. That's the electrical part. Let me show you a little closer. That's how it looks, the base. It has that, that thing, I guess, so it can prevent the chipping to get damaged because this is like a delicate, delicate part of, it, of the of the figure. It's, this whole part looks super sturdy, like super hard. I don't want to bend it, but it looks, it looks hard enough. But... This part looks like super fragile. This whole thing. This is how the base looks. Those are like the steel beams. Look at this is part of a, a ship. And this is. And this. This base, let me let me tell you, is this super heavy. And that's how, how it looks. Let me keep assembling it, and I'll show you more in a few seconds. Hold on. Okay, here's how Ace looks. A close-up of the actual character without the base. This is how it looks. Has like a has like a burning foot. I don't know if you can see it there. It's kind of like burned because I guess because he's in flames, right? This is the back back part of it. The logo of the white bird pirates. His hair. His hand and the other hand. And those things at the top there, they look like super fragile. So that's how it looks. So let me keep us assembling Ace and I'll show it to you when I'm done. Okay, I removed the, the big fireball. Then I put it on the base. I. I found this little base and I thought I thought you had to put it below but no you had to put this one first it will tell you there's like a little see uh, it doesn't show it here but it tells you kind of like the shape and there's like a little a little rectangle that you had to follow and then just put it there let me, let me see if I can show you, kind of like, now nah, it's going to be hard, I only have one, so, 
but I'll remove that part and show it to you real quick. It's like a little rectangle, trapezoid or whatever. It goes down like super quick. And then after that, after you put the ball in, you put this one. And it's it's pretty straightforward. Let me let me hold on, let me let me show you so you can know what I'm talking about. Hold okay, on. I removed this part from there. So you can see uh, the same little little base or rectangle or trapezoid or whatever you want to call it there's like a bigger one on the fireball you just follow that from up, up to down and then you will put the fireball and then you have to be super careful because this one barely fits see it's like this one is bigger sometimes through the hole so you have to put it through and then just remember that that part, the end part, this one, it will go to that. I don't know if you can see the little gap. There's the little gap, kind of like in the middle. Let me see if I can, if I can like zoom it on that little gap. Oh, so you put it there, and that's how you put it. So now let me. Let me show you the whole thing. I know, by the way, I left those styrofoam there because I'm planning to put it back in the box. Maybe I will sell it. Maybe I will, I will, I'll open it until I have my bookcase because I need to build one for it because this one is huge. But I'm just gonna leave them there for now. So let me put that thing again and show the whole figure to you. Hold on. Okay, here you go. And you can see the paper. <laughs> That's fine. Uh, this is how Ace looks after I assemble the whole thing. I didn't show you the... I think I didn't show you how to put the chain, I had to put the, the metal part and the little locks. But that one's pretty straightforward. For the chain, let me show you. And also, you're gonna have like close ups. For the chain, on that part, on that part, there's gonna have like a little uh, magnet that so you put it there. And on this part, on this part, there's gonna be a little pin. So you have to. What I had to do for mine, once I put this one there, I had to bend it a little bit so it can fit there. And then for the metal part, for that metal part, it's the same thing. Just make sure that you put the chain first on the hole and then you just put it with the magnet down there. The other ones, this ones are straightforward. They just go in with a magnet and that one the same thing. And that's it. This is how it looks. It looks like white because I didn't, like I told you, like I didn't remove the styrofoam. But this is how it looks. Let me see if I can rotate it a little bit. I wish I had like a turntable or something. The white bear logo. This is how it looks. The big fireball. The big uh, smoke cloud. Uh, let me do a closer look. This is how the metal bars look. The fire. Ace. Let's see if I can do the face so you can see the ace face. There you go. This is how you can see the face of ace. Oh, come on. There you go. The body. His hands. The cha I guess the shackles or chains. 
the big ball again. Let me show you the structure because I think I didn't show you that. Looks pretty good. How they detail all the, the wood logs or timber. I don't know. You like this, call it timber instead of wood. It's the same thing, but you never know. This is how you look from above. That is a fireball again. Let me show you kind of like the inside of it. Let me see if I can show you. Uh, let me let me do it by hand and I will show it to you on the other side. Hold on. Okay. I didn't want to rotate it with one hand because this thing is heavy. What I think I appreciate from Sume is that man they, they, they make this one super heavy. I don't think I didn't assemble the white bear one, but this one is like the base is like super super heavy, which is pretty good. Here's the the detail on the on the fireball. And I'm pretty sure you're gonna put in the comments like it's not a fireball, it's whatever the <laughs> I'm a fan of one piece but I don't know any any detail like I know there's like a lot of people that will know every detail of the whole thing and but look up can you see a head? I don't think so right now. Well there you go. That's how it looks. And let me rotate it so you can see a final look. Okay there you go. This is the final look without turning on the the figure. Now I need to turn it on so you guys can see how the figure looks. So far it's like amazing. I don't even have to light it up and it's like way way too cool. Thank you Sumi. You did a, a great 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 figure. Let me light it up so you can see it. Hold on. Okay there you go. This is how Ace looks with the lights on pretty cool right and all the flames there all the flames there looks pretty good I forgot to put the other hold on I forgot to put this cross but but that's okay <laughs> And it was a hassle to put it put it on and everything because this figure looks like it's super fragile. So be careful when you're assembling assembling the the figure and enjoy your figure. If you don't have it, I guess try to find it on eBay or or there's like a there's like a community in Sume also. You can find people that they they or they just want to get rid of their figures or, or they just want to sell it. They're gonna be expensive, but I think they're worth it. If you're a true fan, you have to have them. So there you go. I hope you enjoy the enjoy the review, and and I hope I like that effect. I didn't saw it before. That they it will go out and they will start again. So I hope you enjoyed the review and hit the like button or subscribe button or whatever is on YouTube and I hope I can see you. I need I think I need to do the other one for the Robin figure so I'll be back. And I also have like a Darth Vader one coming up and a Han Solo one if you like Star Wars. So stay tuned and see you. See you later. Bye-bye.